Doctors at Rochester General Hospital tell us many of the beds there are empty, and they believe it's because people are scared to come to the emergency room even when they should. Dr. Jerry Gasiak of Rochester General Hospital is worried about people who stay home with serious symptoms. There was a woman this weekend who uh, the family said she'd had some indigestion feelings for three or four days, did not get seen, came in this weekend in extreme situation and ended up passing, where if we had seen her a few days earlier, possibly we could have saved her. And it stretches beyond just one person, he says. We've seen a dramatic drop in the number of heart attacks and strokes coming into the hospital. Uh, dramatic, like two-thirds reduction. I mean, really bad. Public Health Commissioner Dr. Michael Mendoza agrees. Since there are a whole host of people in our community who, for whatever reason, have not sought um, care that's not even elective, care that's important. And we're seeing the consequences of this in our hospitals. We're seeing people presenting to care uh, later than they should because of concern about hospitals and social distancing. So the takeaway, doctors urge, should be... We're still open. You're not going to get COVID by coming into the hospital. I can tell you we're all wearing these things. Um, you're not going to catch it from us. It's a very safe place to come. Doctors tell us they are being extra careful, separating people in the waiting rooms, getting them into separate rooms right away, and always wearing protective gear. In Rochester, Rebecca Fath, News 8.